Twilight German, click on the wrong window. Welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen, to the best XCOM game out of all of them that have been ever made. The new versions have a completely different strategy um, sequence to them, and they play very differently. The new ones, like XCOM Enemy Unknown, Enemy Within, XCOM 2, The Chosen, all the new ones um, that you've basically got two turn-based uh, movements, focuses a lot on the on the soldiers like your soldiers have a ton of value the longer they are alive the more skills they gain which makes them extremely powerful so with the new ones the the more you save the more you keep your soldiers alive the easier it becomes i have finished the new one enemy unknown and i i must say even on um the difficulty that i finished it at i did go check a clip that i had the difficulty that i um finished it at was on classic and it was very difficult at the start but because i saved my game every time i started a mission and whenever one of my favorite characters died or whenever one of my characters dies i loaded it up again and um, that made the game extremely easy at the end but those games still hold a lot of value and they play very differently, but they are not nearly as frustrating as the original, which is, um, I think the European version says it's XCOM Enemy Unknown, but the American version is called XCOM UFO Defense. And it's better to um, split them up that way because the new one that came out in 2012, that's also Enemy Unknown. So I just call it, um, you know, uh, XCOM UFO Defense so that people know what I'm talking about. Now, if you want to play this game, you know, anytime when you watch this video, you need to install this open XCOM. You can easily go search on Google how to install it. So it's very, very simple, the steps that you take. And at the moment, I don't know if the special is still on, but you can get any XCOM game for between 90 to 60% off. Um, I paid $3 for the new Enemy Unknown. And I, I don't know how, my, how much I paid for this. It was an extremely cheap price. But all you do is you buy it on Steam, the, the old one, okay, which is available on Steam. And then you install it. But you don't play the game through the Steam version. You just buy it and you install it. Then you go onto the internet and you install the open XCOM um, modification or program and then you run the game through the program that they gave you because as soon as you install open xcom it's going to detect um that you've installed xcom on steam and it's going to uh, modify the game for you to just remove all the bugs make it more difficult and just give you a lot more options that will make 
the, your experience fantastic even now in 2024. I promise you guys, if you've, if you've never played this game before, trust me. And I'm going to show you the best settings that I have figured out over the last uh, month or two because I have become addicted to the game. Um, it is an extreme PvE challenge, and I feel I've almost mastered it. Not completely, but I feel I've almost mastered it. So if you guys want a basic tutorial or a basic guide on, on this game, I'm going to be explaining things to you as I'm playing the game. Um, Avenger, a friend of mine, is going to stream this at the same time, and he's going to play on the same ex exact same difficulty level and exact same settings. But to make your experience as um, enjoyable as possible and keep as close as possible to the original XCOM um, settings, I'm going to show you the settings that I've changed. All the settings that I've changed have just made the game more difficult more realistic and in some ways it has changed the last mission which is on mars if you don't change if you don't do the mod that i enabled on on this version i call this the ultimate version because if you have played enemy unknown the newer one then you will know when you finish the game they can't mind control you unless they see you and you cannot mind control an alien unless you see the alien. And that makes the last mission a lot more difficult. Where if you just play the vanilla settings, the last mission is going to be extremely easy. And it definitely bothered me that the entire game was difficult. And then as soon as I trained three soldiers to get their psionic um, strength over 120, None of the aliens could mind control me, and I could mind control any alien. So the settings that I'm showing you is to make the game way look way nicer, um, control 10 times better, feel way more realistic, and it makes the final um, mission on Mars feel like a final mission instead of, uh, instead of extremely easy. Because uh, most people that finish the Mars mission, they just go in there with the tank and their psionic um, soldiers. They take the tank out. They see an alien. They take over the alien. They walk the alien to see another alien. They take, uh, take over that alien. They just keep on taking over aliens until um, they get to the main room and they kill the brain. Okay, They kill the final boss without moving a soldier, which is extremely boring very underwhelming so that is why i did what i did so we're gonna there's a new game load game we're gonna start at mods the only mods that i activated here is aliens pick up weapons i feel it's realistic because i can pick up my weapon if my soldier panics um or my you know or my soldier drops his weapon well as soon as he calms down he can pick up his weapon again where an alien can't okay so again, this makes the game more dangerous, more difficult, but more realistic as well. So I just said, if they drop their gun due to panicking, they are able to pick their gun up again. Then this is the big thing. Psionic line of fire. So this is what it says. Psionic weapons, both XCOM and aliens. Very important, guys. Both me and the aliens. Can only, can only be used with direct line of sight to the target. So that works exactly like the new um, uh, XCOM Enemy Unknown, and it makes the last mission way more um, epic, if you have to put it that way, okay? I have to see someone to mind control them, and they have to see me to mind control me, okay? It just makes the final, the final um, it makes Mars better because mars is boring when you take your time to level up your sonic strength on your soldiers and then you finish the last mission with your eyes closed okay so this is not making the game easier it's making it more realistic and i remember when i played enemy unknown the new one that felt better the fact that they had to see me to mind control me and i had to see them to mind control them that made the final mission 
in the new Enemy Unknown a lot more enjoyable when I finished it in 2012. Then the last one is High Explosive Damage. This just makes, gives high explosives a little bit more of a use. So increases the high explosive damage to 200, letting it pierce UFO walls. Very important, pierce, okay? This doesn't mean you blow away half of the UFO and kill aliens very easily, no. This means if you throw a high explosive next to a UFO, it will open one block. It will blow away one block of the UFO, like, a, like the little door that you go through. It will only blow away that door. So it just gives high explosives a little bit more uh, versatility, you know? And without the setting, I don't really use high explosives. With the setting, I want to use high explosives. So again, makes it more realistic and more fun. And that, that is it. That is it, guys. In the mods, they pick up the weapons. They have to see you and you have to see them to use sonic powers. And you can use high explosives to open a little hole on a UFO, tactically, if you want to, okay? Then, very, very big parts of the game is the video. The game still looks like the DOS version without these settings. So I want you to go to the Geoscape scale and make it two times the original. I want you to go to the Battlescape scale and make it two times the original. And that's about it. You can go borderless and letterbox. That's it. These two settings will make the Geoscape look like high resolution, it will make the geoscape like the planet. It will make the planet look more crisp, brighter, nicer. Okay. Um, so it's just positive, it's just better for the eyes. This will make the battle or the that's what makes the earth look better. The battlescape means your people are a bit further away. You can see a little bit more on the map and you don't have to scroll yourself to death. You know, you don't have to move the screen everywhere. Um, so that helps a lot. Then when we go to audio, nothing much changes here. My music's quite low. I'll put the SFX volume a little bit up, a little bit up, okay? A little bit more. Yeah, let's make it a little bit more epic. And then controls, you can always learn the shortcut keys. Geoscape, um, very important here is that you put the countries and the radars on, just, um, just to let you know. I didn't really change anything here, to be honest. Dogfight speed, clock speed, scroll speed. I didn't change anything here. But again, here comes the important thing. Um, your player movement, please make this at least 50%. Your characters don't move very, very, very fast. And it takes a lot of time. Like the most tedious part about this game is moving all your soldiers out of the Sky Ranger. Okay? All the other parts of the game is fun. but moving every soldier out of the sky ranger is going to become very repeated and tedious okay so increase the movement of your players and please click the time units because the thing with with this game is if you have moved a soldier and you want to choose another soldier let's say you move the soldier into a very tactical position He's your most important character. And now you want to select a different soldier. If you don't click directly on that soldier, like UFO, the new XCOM, you have to left click or right click. Left click and then right click to move the soldier. With this game, everything is left click, okay? So if you've moved the soldier into a very tactical position and you want to click on another soldier and you misclick that soldier, it will automatically give a movement command. And that will cause that soldier to die. It's very, very frustrating in this game if you just want to change soldier. Like a lot of people use tab to not do this. A lot of people change their characters by pressing tab. But I like to click on my characters with the mouse. I like just using the mouse. I don't really use the hotkeys. So if you don't like using hotkeys or remembering hotkeys, then click time units. What it will do is, when you click move the first time, it will show you how much time units you will have left by the time you've done the movement. And then you have to click a second one to, um, to get there, okay? So very, 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 very important quality of life, this one. Then the fire speed, you can make it a little bit slower, okay? Will help you to maybe just see a little bit better where the aliens are firing from. A lot of the times, the firing speed is very fast, 
and you don't really see you know where the aliens fired from and then the ui the tool tips and the death notifications we put the death notifications on because it's nice to see who died like i'm sure you're not going to be attached to all your soldiers but you are going to have main soldiers and what i mean by main soldiers is someone in your team is going to become a commander and someone is going to become a colonel other people are going to become colonels if you lose these players they they um, give your whole team a big morale boost but if you lose the, your commander all your your entire squad loses a lot of morale and all of them will panic so the death notification is just nice to see who died okay if you don't want to play iron man like i'm going to do now and you don't want to waste any time you know and you don't want to try and think who died put the death notification on so you can see who died and if your favorite character died you can just load the previous save okay instead of going like instead of wasting time and then five minutes later noticing that your main guy died and then loading up again so that's the only setting there advanced uh very very important settings here the top ones aren't really important but here at geoscape uh, i put on realistic globe lighting again just to make the game look better field promotions again more realistic this doesn't make nothing that i've done makes the game easier makes it defeat more difficult and more realistic so field promotions means only soldiers that were present at the mission site are eligible for promotions i think it's completely broken that one of my rookies or one of my scouts can be injured and then while they're in the sick bay and i'm doing missions he levels up like he becomes the commander instead of the guys on the on the battlefield okay so I think this is a broken thing in in this game that people in in your base, you know, that's injured gets promoted when other people are doing the mission. So again, just very very realistic. And then here at Battlescape, we put on um inventory stats. Again, just quality of life, letting you know which characters are strong, what's the firing accuracy. Um just again, we making it this uh, disable auto equip Let's you take some time when you first land your ship because you have to equip your soldiers instead of the game auto equipping your soldiers. But the game doesn't always auto equip your soldiers right. And it's nice for you to equip the soldiers because you've named them probably and you want to be attached to them. So you want to give you know your special soldiers the good guns and the poop soldiers your poop guns. Okay. So this takes a bit of time. All this does is saves you time so that when you're giving out weapons, you can see who's got the most strength, you know, who's got the highest firing accuracy. Enhanced soldier sprites, changes soldiers' battlescape prides to match the inventory look. Okay, so instead of just having blonde, blonde guys and and blonde girls, okay, each and every character looks like he really looks in the inventory screen. And this is a fantastic change. Instant grenades. Usually when you throw a grenade, it doesn't go off until you end the turn, which is very unrealistic for me. In real life, when you throw a grenade, it will go off. This makes the game a lot more challenging because you can't just throw a grenade and get away from the explosion later, or you can't throw a high explosive and then get the soldiers out of the way. You can, like you, with the high explosives, you can time them but this makes it so that when you throw something it goes off okay just another great quality of life auto end battle helps a lot when you've killed the last alien the mission ends okay otherwise you're wasting time moving around all your soldiers and then finding out at the end you know the mission is over so just auto end when the last alien's dead is done smooth bullet camera is just auto explanatory disable auto equip just means you decide who gets what and then we've got um, override line of fire. A lot of the time the game doesn't want you to shoot, which is good because there's something in your way, but maybe you want to use a soldier to remove what is in your way. So then you can hold control and it will fire. It doesn't matter what is in its way, the guy will fire and remove whatever it's in, is in its way. Like if there's a tree in your way, you can shoot your gun, you know, hold control, shoot, get the tree away and let the guy behind you, sh you know, shoot the alien because the tree isn't in your way anymore uh, and then alien bleeding another realistic thing 
Um, we made it so that aliens can pick up their guns, which makes it more difficult. Aliens bleeding just is the same as us. We bleed, they bleed. So they can get fatal wounds just like us. And that's that, guys. That is it. And that is why I call this, this version with my settings, I call the, the ultimate version. This is the most fun you can have. And there's a lot of... Um, this game is fantastic when it comes to strategizing, figuring out different things, learning different things. It is very challenging if you've never played the game before, but there's, there's a lot of fun and reward for mastering every aspect of this game. And it is by far more difficult than other, any other of the UFO games. Okay. I do enjoy the other UFO games, the newer ones. But this one is by far the greatest, just like Wing Commander 1, okay? Um, other games that came out the first time. So what me and Avenger is going to do, we're going to start a new game. I've got saved games here, but we're going to start a new game. We're going to go super, Superhuman. We're going to go Iron Man. So you can't save, okay? The game saves every move you make automatically. So as soon as one of your characters dies, that was a move. So you can't load it that you can only exit the game. So as soon as one of your characters dies, the game saves it. And when you, if you want to load it, if you want to exit the game and load it again, it will load where the character died, okay? So no saving, no saving your character. Once someone is dead, he's dead forever. This forces you to be very vigilant, to think about every decision you make. And it makes this game fantastic, like as realistic as it gets. Like, that's realistic. If a guy's dead, he's dead. You can't get more realistic than that, okay? Superhuman, the most difficult level on this open XCOM, which is more difficult than the original, because if you play the original XCOM and you don't install this open XCOM, then all your difficulty levels are actually beginner. You might think you're playing superhuman, but you're actually playing beginner, okay? Because there's a lot of bugs in the old one. This one fixed all the bugs, and I've I have finished the old one when I was young, and I have finished this one, and I can see there's a major difference. So let's go. Here we go. As you guys can see, the, the geoscape looks a lot sharper, a lot nicer. The colors look a little bit more vibrant, okay? Everything just looks sharper. You can see the menu is much smaller on this side, but as you guys can see, it just looks, it looks a lot sharper, okay? And I'd like to get my mouse to work a little bit faster here. Okay, there we go. So, um, you have to choose a country. You can uh, zoom in a little bit. So, we have to choose a country. A lot of people build their bases here because it's got the most countries in. But, you know, I'm just going to go to the USA. And I'm going to I'm gonna cover USA and Canada. That's about it. Okay. We're going to click there. And we're going to call it the XCOM Headquarters. And now it tells you, give me a save. I've got Iron Man, I've got XCOM training, and I've got a superhuman challenge that I'm doing with my son. Okay, so I'm already on a superhuman challenge, but that I'm doing with, with my son. I've got, I've got uh, where I did all my training, you know, tested various things. And then I just uh, finished the game on beginner to understand you know what will help the game to be better and what won't help the game to be better so we're going to choose a new save and we're going to call it iron man and superhuman oh yeah the superhuman that me and blue odd is doing is not is not iron man guys Again, you know, we te we tested Superhuman as well, but not with Iron Man, so we can load and save the way we want. So there, we've only got one save, and that's that. Now, the first, you are starting at 1st January, 12 o'clock. What you do here is extremely important. If you miss anything here, you're affecting the game in a major way. So first thing I do is I go build facilities, and I start from the bottom. Do I need a hangar? No. Do I need alien containment? Yes. Uh, some people change their base layout to make base invasions easier. That's not realistic. Trying to make the game easier for yourself is not realistic, okay? Um, general stores, yes. General stores are important. Missile defenses, not now. 
And even if you do have missile defenses, it's not going to stop them from landing in your base, okay? Um, I have had a lot of missile defenses at my base. I have shot down UFOs trying to attack my base. You can shoot down 10 different UFOs. An, an 11th one will come and they will. you will have to do a base defense mission, guys. Um, if, if it comes early in the game, okay? So missile defenses isn't really going to help you, to be honest. Um, large radar, yes, we've got a small one. We need a big one. Um, then we've got the workshop, which is not important because that's for engineers. The laboratory is not important for now, but we need living quarters. Living quarters is very important. I'd like a second living quarters because I'm going to run out of space. How much are these? 400,000. Okay. I bought two living quarters. Okay. That's the first thing I do. Second thing I do is I go to equip craft. And then I take away the items that I don't want to use. I'm not going to use pistols, okay? I'm going to use a rifle. Uh, I don't really want to use armor-piercing ammo on the heavy cannon. I don't really want to use armor-piercing rounds on the auto cannon, but I do want to use the auto cannon. And if the orders that I'm going to place, if the things that I'm going to purchase doesn't come in time, I still want them to have something when there's a mission, okay? I want the rocket launcher, I don't really like small rockets, but I'm going to take it for now. So I'm just going to equip the smoke grenades, give each guy uh, a grenade. So we've got six rifles or six, um, yeah, six rifles, seven, eight, nine. We need 10. We, got, we, we want 10 people in total. So seven rifles with 14 clips means we'll have 10 guns in total. Okay. So I just want to remove all the things that my soldiers aren't going to use so that I can sell it and clear some space in the general stores because the space in your general store sucks when you start playing the game it absolutely sucks okay so um we're gonna go okay then here we've got eight um rookies okay we don't want to start with eight people but we are gonna start with eight people later so the first thing then i the the next thing is sell i want to sell everything that i'm not going to use oh sorry when it comes to equip sky the interceptor, I want to give one interceptor and avalanche. The cannons are really useless. The only reason you want to use a cannon is if you shoot down a very small UFO and you don't want to destroy it. But a very small UFO only has one alien. So it's a waste of time. Okay, so we're going to equip the one avalanche that we have there on interceptor one. And then on the next interceptor, we're just going to equip a, a stingray. So now we know we're not going to use any cannons. So now when we go sell, we sell all the cannons, which will free up a lot of space in our general stores. And we're going to... We don't want to sell missiles ever, okay? Sell the pistols, sell the pistol clips, sell the armor-piercing ammo here. Um, that's fine. We haven't got anything else to sell. We've got three extra grenades. We'll sell that as well. Okay. That opened up some space in our general stores. And here comes the important thing. Very important you want a tank as soon as possible. What tank you choose is up to you. I like blowing stuff up. And on a terror mission, I don't try and reserve life at all. So, the, like, I can use the tank tactically, but on a, on a terror mission, which is the most difficult, I just like killing the aliens as fast as possible and big rockets is what you need okay so we're gonna buy we're gonna buy the tank very important you have to buy at least um eight rockets if you don't buy eight rockets you wasted all the time waiting for the tank because if you just buy two rockets it will tell you it can't equip the tank and you can't take the tank onto the mission it's the same with the, with this one to take the this tank on a mission you're going to waste time bu buying one round. You need to buy 30 rounds to equip the normal tank. Again, what you do at the start of the game makes a major difference, okay? And the first three months in XCOM is extremely important. So try and play as effectively as possible. So we need at least eight rockets. I'm going to see if I can get to 16. Okay, I can get to 16. So I cleared up a lot of space. And in the general stores. Okay, I want the heat-seeking stuff for the heavy cannon. I want the heat or the high explosives. I want the high explosive um, rounds.
for the heavy cannon than the auto cannon. I want large rockets for the rocket launcher to blow things up. I want five extra smoke grenades because smoke grenades is everything in this game. If you don't want to die, you know, from an alien um, from far away, use the smoke. Smoke will save your life. Proximity grenade. Um, I don't really use them, but I'm going to buy them now. High explosives. I like to have at least one on me. I give all my soldiers a stun rod because I will explain to you guys why a stun rod is important later in the game. And then I bought electric fizz. If you didn't clear the general stores like I showed you guys, you will struggle to buy the stuff that I've bought here. It will be almost impossible. You, you won't even be able to buy the tank. You won't be able to buy the tank or the rockets because your it will say your store space is full. Okay, so all of these things count. And very, 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 very important, start the research. You start with laser weapons, guys. Medikits only make sense once your guys can reliably take a shot. At the beginning of the game, your guys can't take a shot reliably. It can happen that they can survive a shot, but it's very unlikely. So laser weapons wins with priority. So always start your research. And then let me just gather my thoughts here quickly oh the soldiers okay this is another fun part of the game the name will tell you roughly what kind of character it is like dragomir will be probably from germany steven will be a guy um bilal cormac mark ellis will be a girl okay so what you're looking for is i don't we, are we going to name all the soldiers but what i'm looking for is avenger and me are going to have two very important characters. Luthias, my character, is going to become the commander, and Avenger is going to become my colonel, my second in charge. On his playthrough, he's going to try and make his character the commander, and it's easy to do that. You just make sure that guy kills the most units on the battlefield, and I'm going to be his colonel. Now, Alice is a woman, so although she's got great stats, I cannot be her. So someone else has to be her in the chat. She's very, very, very accurate. And I'm just going to do it fairly and start right at the top of the chat. Let me quickly just um, greet my chat. Fabijan, Cody, Airborne, Locksmith, Explicit, Avenger, Janice, Flavio, Sledgehammer, uh, Varos, um, Sam, Victor, and Nico Boy, mercy, welcome guys. Have we got a have we got a lady in the chat? Have we got a lady in the chat? If there's a woman in the chat, please say me. I can't see any ladies in the chat. We need to make you a soldier in my party. So please just say I if you're a woman in real life. Not if you want to be a woman, not if you identify as a woman, if you are a woman. If you were born a woman, then please say I. No woman in the chat. Lol. Okay, well, the response is not fast enough, so we're just going to go Luna. We're just going to go Luna Dark. Luna Dark is our friendly lady on um, New Dawn. So we got Luna. Next character looks standard. Looks like a standard character. I'm not going to give you guys any any soldier with 10 um, bravery, okay? None of you are cowards, so no one with 10 bravery. So we're just going to start from the top. Fabijan type first. So this is Fabijan. Okay, next soldier, 10. No, this is a scout. So we're going to go scout. We don't care what his name is. He's going to die. We don't want to know what his name is. He's going to die. Okay. Next is Bilal. I don't know if Bilal is a woman's name, but that is going to be Cody. Kodish. We're going to go Kodish. Okay. That's going to be Kodish. Shin. I don't know who Shin is, but it's a good soldier. So Shin is going to be airborne. All of you are going to have characters, guys, because you have to have 30 soldiers for one of the soldiers to become a commander. 
No one can become a commander in your squad if you don't have 30 soldiers in total. So all of you will be in the in you know all of you will be in the game if I have to put it that way. Okay, next character also looks good, and that's gonna be explicit. Dragomir. Explicit. Okay. And then after explicit is a no Avenger. Me and Avenger have to have special characters. I think this is a special character. 69 firing. The highest firing you can start with is 70. So this is a very, very, very special character. Let me see, is there a better one? 68. It's, no, that's Luna. No, no. Okay, so I'm going to be Steven. Unless I find a very better character, guys, but I don't know if I'm going to get a better, a better character. I don't want to make this guy Avenger because... Of course, he's got 20 bravery. 20 bravery isn't bad, but I mean, Avenger is going to be my colonel. Okay, so we need to make him very, very brave. So the next one is going to be Flavio. Flavio. Flavio, don't worry. It's still going to be good. Okay. So that's that. Now we're going to purchase. Again, I've worked everything in this game out to a T, ladies and gentlemen. I can buy 12 soldiers, which will put my total to 20 in total. And I can buy 10 scientists at the start of the game. How do you know that's the exact number, Luthias? Because I've worked everything out to the T. Okay. So there we go. So now you can go to base information, transfers, and you can see how long everything is going to take to get to you. Now, because I don't want to waste any more of your guys' time, like I've been explaining things for like 30 minutes, we're going to take the timer to a day, okay? Um, just so that everything happens really quickly. Okay, we got the... Um, high explosives ammo. We got the large rockets, proximity, high explosive stun, flare. We don't want to go to the base yet. We need the tank. We need the tank. We got the rockets. That's not the tank. We got the soldiers and the scientists. Okay, now we want to go to the base because we want to allocate the scientists immediately. So we want to allocate, add the scientists to that research project immediately. And then we want to see if we can get better soldiers and name the rest of you. Okay? So... We're going to go to this guy. Looks fine. Looks fine. So, Ole. Ole, I don't think Ole. Uh, Janice, I am going to put you in the team. But I think, Janice, I think you're a, you're a female. So, we're going to call this guy Sledge. Sledgehammer. I'm just going down the chat, guys. Just going down the chat. Nelson. Nelson qualifies. Faros. Barros is going to be Nelson. Patrick is a guy's name. A lot of bravery. A ton of bravery. Not a ton of firing accuracy, but a ton of bravery. Let's see who's next on the list. And it's a man again. Sam. Sam. Okay, Sam will be the brave one. Just because he's next on the list. And we get a goal. Radoslav. Raduslav, I think that's a guy, and he's got a great stats. This is going to be Avenger. This is going to be Avenger. Unless we get a better soldier, this is going to be Avenger, okay? Very high firing accuracy, good bravery, just good all around. So that's Avenger. Abhijay Kumar, I think that's a guy. So after Sam, we're going to have... Victor. We're going to have Victor. Victor. Come on. Why are you not typing? Why are you not typing, bro? Victor. There we go. Victor Quinn Cannon. Okay. Victor, you've got a right firing accuracy. Stats don't look too bad. Fortini. I don't know Fortini, but I'm, we're going to call this Janice. We're going to call this character Janice. I don't know if that's a girl, but Janice needs to be included before I forget about Janice. Okay. Then the next character has got 70 accuracy. Holy poop in a dupe scoop. Sebastian. Sebastian has got... Th 
Okay, this is the new Luthias. Luthias. That's the new Luthias. We're going to have to re repeat, replace the previous Luthias. Olivier. Olivier is a nice name. Aurora. Nico Boy. Uh, these stats aren't fantastic. We're going to make him a scout. We need scouts. We've got way too little scouts. We need scouts. Oh, that's better. So mean. Okay, that's Nico Boy. Okay. This is another Scout 10 Bravery. And I don't... Guys, I'm not going to call him Scout 1 or Scout 2. A Scout is a Scout. We don't care about them. They're going to die. This is another Adam Evans. Strong character. Cameron. Cameron's going to be this one. Okay. Okay, and this one is going to be Chief. This one's... No, it's Claudia. It's a woman. It's a woman. It's a woman. Cameron, what does I mean? I. I've never seen a game so to me. So I'm Okay. Claudia, we're going to make this Trinity. Okay, we're just going to make this Trinity so that she's in here as well. Trinity. And I'm sure you guys know who I'm going to make the other Luthias. If you don't know, shame on you. Shame on you. Poro, my brother from another mother. There we go. So now, everyone is named. Okay? And now, we're going to equip the craft. So, first of all, Luthias has to be on the craft. Luthias has to be on the craft. And I want him to go out second. We need a scout to go out first. That whoever goes out of the plane first, they usually die. Okay, they usually die. So we want a scout to go out. Then I want me second. I want Avenger or uh, me third, Avenger fourth. Luna can back me up with Toro. Toro Luna, and then we put the explicit here, explicit Fabijan, the scout scout. Luthai's Avenger, Toro Luna, Explicit Fabijan, Kodish, and Airborne, Flavio. Flavio. And I'm just going to go down the list, guys. Sledgehammer. Okay, there we go. We can take, take another guy. We're taking this guy. No, we're taking too many people. We're taking too many people. What just happened? We can only take 10 players, 10 soldiers, because the the tank will take four spots. But don't worry. People will die. Guys. The only, my only mission is to keep Luthias and Avenger alive. Most importantly, I need to keep Luthias alive. Because I need to keep the commander alive. And Luthias is going to become the commander. Okay? I'm going to make sure of it. But people will die. Other people will replace them. You guys don't have to worry about that. I need at least two scouts. So somebody is going to have to sit out. Someone's going to have to sit out. We're going to let Airborne sit out and replace him with a scout. We do need two meat shields, for sure. Now, all I need is the tank, and I'm ready. I'm ready. My interceptor's ready. That interceptor's ready. So, give me the tank. Okay, the research is done. Laser, laser guns in this game is very, very important. Heavy lasers is not important. Laser cannons are not important. So you just research lasers until you've researched laser rifles. Then you change your research. Okay. I'm not gonna make. I'm not gonna make. Uh, I'm not gonna make. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not going to manufacture pistols. Although pistols are nice, I'm not gonna manufacture them. Okay. Give me the tank. There we've got the tank, and we're done. We are ready for action. Now you add the tank because you gave the tank enough rockets. Now you go to year. You make sure that each and every heavy gun has got heavy, heavy gear like the heat seeking. And you replace the small poop rockets with the four big rockets. You make sure every soldier has got a smoke grenade. You make sure every soldier has got a proximity grenade. You make sure your strongest guy with the strongest arm has got high explosives. You put the stun rods in. You put the electro flares in. And we are ready battle and once we detect our first ufo 
I just want to thank Toro for giving me this tip. A very, very important resource in the game is Illyrium. You never want to sell Illyrium. You, you use Alien Alloys and Illyrium for all the fancy stuff that you want to manufacture. Alien Alloys is fine because you can manufacture Alien Alloys. You cannot manufacture Illyrium. So you don't want to shoot a UFO down. If you can, you don't want to shoot a UFO down. So with me specializing in this game, or at least I try, I've tried to co conquer this game. What I do is I follow a UFO until he gets to the border. When he gets close to my radar border, I shoot him down. As long as he doesn't get close to the border, I'm going to follow him and hopefully he lands and then I'm going to do the mission so that I can get as many... Um, Aurelium comes from the UFO's power source. If you shoot down a UFO, you're going to probably destroy its power source. Then you don't get any um, Illyrium from the UFO. So you want a UFO to land so that you can get all the goodies from the UFO. And if a terror mission happens, you don't care if you're doing it during the day or the night. If a terror mission happens, you go for it. You don't waste 10 seconds. You go for it. If a UFO lands you can you should try and get there as soon as possible but the all i'm trying to say is if you shoot a ufo down it's not going anywhere i don't know how long it will take them to repair the ufo but if a ufo crash lands wait for daytime you don't want to play during the night so that's it guys i'm gonna go get myself a refreshment quickly because i've spoken my throat dry and then I'm going to quickly go through all the chat that you guys don't feel ignored. Get ready for Superhuman Iron Man, the ultimate edition. I'll be back right now.
Okay, guys, nature called as well, and I had to answer her. So let's get to the chat. Goodness gracious, that was non-stop talking. Um, Bobby John, welcome, Cody, Airborne. Still my favorite all-time game. Uh, it's definitely Wing Commander is number one. Yeah, that's number two. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Wing Commander is number one. This game is number two of old games. Scum is definitely my favorite. Nothing takes Scum's place now. But from that time, Wing Commander and uh, this game. Explicit, welcome, Akazi. Avengers probably streaming now. Just remind him, guys, he has to be the commander. I have to be the colonel. If I, if he loses me or he, if he loses himself, he can always try and replace the guys, but he must make sure they're high level. Janice, welcome. And Flavio, Sledgehammer. Ross, welcome. Sam, welcome, buddy. Victor, welcome. And... And, and the best thing is anyone can play this game. I don't care what PC you have. I don't care what PC you have. Anyone can play Wing Commander 1. Anyone can play this game. And you guys will have a ton of fun. A ton of fun. Nico Boy, welcome my brother. For Ross Mercy. Hello, can someone tell me what is the pumpkin meta? No. It's an exploit. You will not hear me help you to do any exploits my friend uh, chief chief i've still got this original game by my pc my first playstation game love it nice i thought about for a nanosecond lord just for this playthrough um uh, enterprise series crewman team he will die soon vicky 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 how did i miss vicky in any case um hopefully i'm at the back of the ship <laughs> if is there any mode or updates for this game no no this the open xcom is the update for the game which makes it the ultimate edition with with the changes that i said at the beginning of the stream that makes it the ultimate experience may my bravery help in the journey and get me in trouble <laughs> Brilliant gameplay, a base building, however, graphics have aged quite bad. Smoke isn't good now. <laughs> yeah, smoke, yeah, smoke looks looks bad, but it definitely saves you. Um all the scouts irrelevant. Okay. We have to get to the end. We have to get to the end here. Yeah. Cameron. Fred, welcome, my man. Uh, I played this game on and off for years when I got it again for the PC. Was all ready to go to end to the end mission. Had troops with high sonic powers, etc. Had to do a fresh install of Windows. Oh my word. Ah, that happened to me with Fallout Tactics. I think twice. I played Fallout Tactics. No, it happened with Fallout Tactics once. And it happened with Fallout 4 once. And once with Fallout Tactics, I I, I finished 90% of the game and I had to reinstall Windows. Something pooped. I had to format the PC. Something pooped. And then with Fallout 4, I also om almost finished it. And then the PC pooped as well. So I know how you feel, bro. I know how you feel. Igniter, hi. For fun, realism, immersion, I suggest to name one character by your name and goal is to keep him safe. If he dies, game over. If he dies, yeah, maybe, maybe there's no other Luthias. If I die, okay, guys. If I die, someone else can become the commander, okay? Yeah, that will add extra difficulty to it. I'll make sure I keep him safe. Eventually, Luthias can't die. Ha, ah, okay, okay. So, let's start with the first mission. Let's go. Small UFO has landed. Holy poop, that's easy. So... I do this. I don't care if the UFO is in the air. I don't care if the UFO is on the ground. I send the Sky Ranger. And I send an Interceptor. I don't care if he's in the air. If he's in the air, I'm going to follow him with the Interceptor and the Sky Ranger. Until, you know, until he lands or until he gets close to the border. And then I'm going to shoot him down. 
But in any case, now I'm going to patrol with this one. I'm going to patrol. If he get, if 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 he comes up, I'll shoot him down. Actually, I have to do this mission at night, but I don't want to. I don't want to do the first first mission at night. It's my choice. If he if he comes up, I'll kill him. I want to do this during the day. Please don't. Please, please stay there. Please stay there. Please don't lift off. Please don't lift off. Just a little second longer. A little bit longer. A little bit longer. There we go. Okay. Now I'm going to go Sky Ranger. Land. Go Sky Ranger. Yes. Okay. And because of those changes, now we decide who gets what. Of course, we're going to give the scouts a rifle with the rifle magazine. We're going to give them a proximity grenade because they probably the, they probably going to be the first people into the UFO. We're going to give them two proximity grenades. Um, we're going to give them a stun a, a stun rod because they are going to come face to face with the aliens. And you can you've got space for something else there. A grenade, okay. Another scout, give him a rifle, rifle magazine, two proximity grenades, uh, stun. I don't think you can carry more. No, then you're going over the weight. People say you have to overload your characters to build strength on characters. They're talking poop wash. Poop. They, they're talking poop. Okay. You just load them close to the maximum. I've got a... I've got... I've got the I've got the cool Street Fighter character. I'm very happy. I am very happy. How do you get a lot of kills with your commander? Easy. You just give him rockets, baby. Okay, I can't carry a lot of rockets. That's gonna affect me very, very badly. That's gonna affect me very, very, very badly. What the heck? It's fine, let's overload him. It's fine. Avenger, Avenger is going to shoot the heavy cannon because the heavy cannon is cool. And Avenger can't carry anything else. Okay, yeah, we just want Avenger to get some kills. Getting some kills with that gun is fine. Toro is a bit weak, but we're going to give Toro the auto cannon. He can't take in extra ammunition with him, it's not going to work. Luna Dark. Luna can carry a lot. So she's going to take the rifle, the magazine. She's going to take two grenades. She's going to be like a crazy person. If we have to, Luna's going to breach the wall for us. And she's going to take that with her. Explicit. She's going to take a rifle, a clip. Because these guys aren't going to be in the front, they're going to do the grenade, the grenade things. And I want them to back us up with some smoke grenades. Luna, I want you to back me up with the smoke grenade as well. And always prime the smoke grenades beforehand. Bobby John's going to take a gun and a magazine. And again, he's going to go happy clappy with the grenades. And I, I want him to have a smoke, smoke grenade. He's got time in his left, so you can take that. And then Kodish... Almost finished. I'm gonna give him one, two, and yeah, just one grenade, one grenade, one grenade, one proximity. Then Flavio is gonna get a rifle. He's gonna get two grenades. No, no, he's actually the weaker one. Yeah, Flavio is weak. This guy's stronger. Cody is stronger, so he can carry a lot more. Okay, and there we go. Now, the scouts are going to be the first ones out. So, of course, they have to have smoke grenades that are primed. I don't care if I go over the weight limit. They are going to get rid of the smoke grenades immediately. So, that's fine. How many scouts do we have? Goodness gracious. How many scouts do we have? We've got two scouts. Then me. I just want to shoot. I want to get weight off me as fast as possible. 
armor loot. Don't forget the armor. There is no armor, buddy. There is no armor yet. You have to research the armor, my friend. You have to research the armor. You have to research alien alloys for personal armor. And then you have to research um, UFO power source, UFO navigation for the power suit. Don't worry about it. I got this. I got this. And I feel good. Do I feel good? You know what, Toro? You t no, no. You know what? Yeah, take, yeah, take more smoke. The more smoke, the better. Okay, let's go. Okay, we can't save, so here we go. As you guys can see, it's not as close as last time. You know, you don't have to scroll forever. And of course, the player movement is better. First time you, you start a mission, the aliens will have all their time units. They will be extremely dangerous. So it's not wise to go come out of the spaceship on the first turn. But you can play whichever way you want. I'm just going to play as tactically as possible. And this is cool. These things are going to go off as soon as they land. There we go. And he's going to throw it on top of us. Okay, we're covered with smoke. Now let's give the aliens a chance to move. If they move close to us, it's fine. There's smoke. That was close. That was close. Did the tank get hit? The tank get, didn't get hit. Okay, clearly there's an alien here. Clearly. Now, we have the tank so that it can take the first reaction shots. Because in this game, a reaction shot doesn't work like the new game. As long as you've got enough time units for a snapshot, you will do a snapshot reaction shot. You won't do an aimed reaction shot. You won't do an automatic reaction shot. You will always do a snapshot. So as long as you've got enough time units for a snapshot when you end the turn, and your reaction calculator, which is a bunch of calculations that I've studied, but I cannot explain it to you guys now. That will take an extra 30 minutes. If your reaction calculator beats the alien's reaction calculator, then you win. Or then you can take a reaction shot. But it's it does happen a lot. So he's taking all the reaction shots. Okay, he's taking all the punch here. There is an alien in here. Okay, there we go. So for now, I just want to see everything. Okay, for now, I just want to see everything. That's it. And I don't really want to move any soldier closer to this alien than the tank. Because the aliens prefer to target the tank. So if the tank is the closest target to the alien, it will usually shoot the tank. Which is a good tactic. So, we're going to bring out scout number one first. And he's going to go right here. So, you click once to see how many time units you're going to have left. You click again. He sees the alien. We don't care. Move again. Look at the alien. A snapshot's going to have a 28% chance to land. An auto shot's going to have 16% chance to land. Both of them are terrible. So, I'm going to take three shots at him. Very well, very well done, scout, um, scout. I'm going to move him forward because I usually want the scouts further out than any other unit. I want the scouts to take the punishment. Scout number two is going to come out here. Um, there's an alien in here. I'm just going to see if the scout can see. Okay, the scout cannot see. I'm really scared of this alien right here. This alien right here can cause a lot of problems for us. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move the scout here. And end the turn. We cannot make any mistakes. I fear I, I, cannot, I cannot see that alien. Okay, so he's going to die unless we finish the mission quickly. But let's just say goodbye to Scout. We don't need to worry about Scout. We don't even know what Scout's name is. So it's fine. 
I do... There's a door open there. I do want to see where this alien is. What are you seeing? Oh, there's an alien there now. Okay, okay. I do want to move. I want this tank to eat up all the reaction shots. I want this tank to eat all the reaction shots. Okay, so he took the reaction shot. Now, I feel safe. I don't know if I am safe, but I feel safe. So now, we take bring out the big boys. The fact that I've got so many rockets on me makes it that I can just shoot a snapshot when I've got time. So, overloading my character was not a good idea. But in any case, I am going to get my character into position. Let him look that way. Crouch down. He's got too many rockets on him. Um, Avenger is going to try and kill this guy. How many for an auto? 70 units for an auto. So we're going to put Avenger here. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Give him a snapshot. I think we killed two aliens there. Okay, Avenger is in a good spot. He just killed two aliens. Okay. Now we're going to move out Luna. Try and give her the shortest route. And now we're going to see if she can do this. 32% is almost double of an auto. Almost double of an auto. But we're going to go for an auto. Okay, that was bad, Luna. That was bad. So now we have to do let the scouts do their job. The scouts' job is don't let the commanders die. But the scouts don't have... Oh, the scout does have a grenade. There we go. Scout does have a grenade. Prime the grenade. Zero. How much to throw it? Set 14. Okay. Go stand there. Go stand there. Go stand there! Throw it. There. Damn it! You suck, Scout! Okay, this is bad. 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 This is bad! Okay. Okay, if anyone dies, it's going to be you. If anyone pays, it's going to be you. Twenty-five percent chance. Kneel down. Do not miss. Do not miss. You missed. Okay, it's fine. Um, Poro has got a lot of time units. Poro does not have a lot of time units. Auto is 20 time units. No, he can't fire. He can't fire. So... Since he can't fire, I'm not going to risk his life. I need someone with high time units. Fabijan has got high time units. Fabijan, 21. Go for it. Fabijan. Babru, please. Please! Ah! Two shots and he didn't die. Yes! Okay. The the thing that makes this game th the most difficult is every time you shoot, there's a percentage chance that you hit. Every time you hit an alien, you can either do 0 to 200% damage. Like the rifle does 30, 30 points of damage. 
every time you hit a target, this rifle can either do zero damage or 60 damage. So, and, and anything in between. So every time you shoot a target, it can do between zero and 200% of the weapon's damage. And that is why you shoot an alien six times sometimes and it doesn't die. Because you just got very unlucky with that random number generator. Explicit. Hmm. Okay, she's crouched down. Go, X. No. There, X. No. What about there? No, that's not going to work. What about there? Uh, I don't know. Try it. Yeah, X, if you... Oh, X, you go... Oh, my... Uh, oh, my word. What if you hit her, X? Oh, explicit can possibly hit her, guys. Which is not going to be good. 13% accuracy. Okay, one shot, X. One shot. One shot. It, she's in the way. Yeah, you just shot her in the back. You shot Luna in the back. What about... What about... What about the warning? What about telling me... I can't fire? Oh, my word. Oh my word. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We are in some deep, deep trouble. 10 units. 5 units. Oh my word. Guys, just, just, just. That scout did a perfect job. Scout, I don't know what your name is, Blue, but you are the man. You are the man, Blue. You tanked that shot like a king. I love it. I love it. Okay, I want the tank to take all the reaction shots. Tank, take all the reaction shots. Okay. Now, Luth, where are you? Luth, Luth, you need to kill something. Scout. Um, buddy, um, you need to move this way. Luth, Luth, do not miss, bro. Do not kill your entire team, brother. Do not kill your entire team. Get a kill. Just get a kill. Oh! oh! Luth, my man. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, Avenger, don't do anything stupid. Let, let's just relax. Let's just relax, okay? Um, Scout, go check this out for me. That's what you're here for. Check this area out for me. You just stand there. If everything, anything moves, shoot it. Scout, I don't care if you're going to die. I really don't care if you're going to die. Tell me what's over here. Tell me what's over here. Nothing. Okay. Good one, Scout. Good one. Tank. Make sure you're the target. Papa John, move out. Move out. Okay, I'll move out. Throw the smoke grenade here. Yeah. There we go. Now if an alien comes out the door, he can't just shoot people immediately. Mm, Luna. I know you don't want to sit still, Luna. I know you don't want to sit still. I know you're a hero. So throw that smoke grenade there. And Luna, let's try and finish this mission, shall we? Shall we? Let's try and finish this mission. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. No one wants to see you die, Luna. No one wants to see you die. Okay. Let's do this. Avenger, get yourself into a spot where you can crush anything that moves. That doesn't look like a spot that you can crush anything that moves, but it's fine. Explicit, uh, you can go there. Um, Luth, you are a little bit lighter at least. Now we need to get these boys out of the out of the spaceship. Okay, nothing can be seen on that side, guys. We need to scout this side. We need to scout this side. Just check what's down there for me. Nothing. Can you throw this thing? Yeah, throw it. I don't want you to get shot. Throw it there, okay? The smoke looks like poop, but it keeps us alive, so we do not care. 
I don't care if it looks like poop. As long as we're alive. Oh, sh oh no, he saw someone. He saw someone. Where did I move him to? Where did I move him to? Where? Where's the alien? Where's the alien? Where is the alien? Oh my word, we missed an alien. We missed an alien. I just missed an alien. This is bad. 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 Varos, if it was you that warned me, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry if it was you, buddy. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. Okay. The smoke helps, guys. It's very difficult for them to see us in the smoke, okay? The smoke helps. If we didn't have the smoke, we would have been dead. Trust me. We would have been dead. Uh. Now the scout does see someone and losing a scout just to lose him is not the best idea in the world. But let's get the reaction shots if they have any reaction shots. Okay, no, he didn't reaction fire. But maybe if he gets fired at, then he reaction fires. Let's see if he does a reaction shot. Okay, Scout has done his purpose. He could have shocked him! He could have shocked him, you idiots! No! I don't care about the Scout, guys. I do not care about the Scout. But the Scout had the stun gun on him. The Scout could have just walked up to him, up to him and stunned him. So that he doesn't get shot. But in any case, in any case. He's already done the reaction shot. And explicit says, don't worry, brother. I've got this. Ah! Okay, apparently he had, he had two reaction shots. The tank moved. He didn't shoot the tank. But now he shot explicit. Kazi, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, poop happens, bro. Poop happens. That was bad. Holy poop, that was bad. That was bad. Bobby John. We can't let the slide, buddy. We can't let the slide. You do this, bro. You do this. Oh, it's soccer! Okay. Get the tank close. If an alien comes out, he will shoot the tank. Go, Dish. Want you to scope out the area for me a bit, bud? Um, Captain, I want you to get into a better, a better area. Avenger, Luna, 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 let's, let's clear this place, let's clear this place out. Uh, Flavio, come around this side. As I told you guys, people are gonna die, I wasn't expecting... Like I did everything there to not let Hexplicit die, but that's what makes the game so good. Sometimes you can do everything in your power to not lose a soldier, and you still lose him. Okay, he's done, he's done, he's done, he's done, he's done, he's done, he's done. Scout. Scout, you can do a little bit more. Look that way. Um... Come a bit this way. Come a bit this way. Come spot something here for me. Okay. Now we're done. That was just a smoke grenade. Relax, guys.
Okay, I want an alien to come out. I want an alien to come out because Luthias needs kills. Luthias needs kills. So, there we go. Toro is going to stand us back up here. Luna is going to clear this, this, this place. She's just going to make sure for us no one is... She's going to make sure no one's on the roof. The scout is going to make sure Luna survives by risking his life. Okay, there's no one there. Scout, just, I don't know, scout. I don't know, go stand there. The tank is going to make sure no one's hiding over here. No one's hiding over there. Now the tank's going to make sure no one's hiding over there. And now I'm the only target that the alien is going to shoot at. Although I do think the tank's closer than me. But that is still not good. That is still not good. Who are you? Kodish? Protect the commander at all costs. Be the body shield. Flavio? Come here. Avenger? Come here. Although you guys are a bit too close, I'm going to shoot a rocket. I'm going to shoot a rocket. Just stand like this. I'm probably going to shoot a rocket, so... Rather safe than sorry. Yeah, Toro, you guys are a little bit too close as well, my bro. No, 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 no. You guys are a little bit close as well. Um, stand a little bit back. Me and a rocket launcher? Never good results. Never, never good results. You guys know that better than anyone. Okay, let's go. There was movement. There was movement. You guys see, I can't even see the alien. Okay, you guys see how powerful the smoke is? The smoke works for you, but it works for them as well. So you just want the smoke on you, or you just want the smoke to cover you. You don't really want to go this insane, but I mean, it, it did the purpose. It made sure this alien doesn't see anyone, but I have to do effort to see him. You see? You see how close I have to get to him with smoke to see him. No, no, no. These reaction tabs don't don't matter, buddy. The reaction tabs don't matter. No matter. Don't worry about it. Get out of my way. Shoot. Please don't shoot them. Please don't shoot them. Brilliant. Okay, you're done, Lutias. You're done. You got two kills, bro. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, now, scout. The aliens are inside here. There's no doubt about it. Okay, we're going to put this tank here to, to protect you a little bit. But you need to, like, brother, you need to, you, you need to, you need to do your thing. You need to do your thing, brother. You need to do your thing. You need to become a hero. Scout, we're not going to move anyone closer, unfortunately. We're going to move Avenger closer because Avenger needs a kill. And that's about it. We're going to move Toro closer because maybe he can get a kill. We're going to move this guy closer just because they are here. Just because they are here. Okay, so the guy's inside there. Shock him. What? <gasps> Luna! I think he's by you. No. I think he's upstairs. Oh! He's upstairs, Luna! Luna, baby! Luna survived. Yes, baby. Okay, guys. We don't care. We we don't care about the scouts, but let's just have 10 seconds of silence for explicit. The commander made a bit of a judgment mistake there. And the scout could have killed that alien with the stun rod. So we could have actually saved the explicit if we just remembered that that scout was close enough to kill him with a stun rod. But in any case, here's the stats.
as you guys see, I overloaded my character, but it's more about kills. I did gain the most amount of strength, but it is more about kills, okay? I have overloaded characters on purpose. It didn't really upgrade their strength. It's basically what you do in the fight that matters. And because Luthias was the most active, it mattered. Because Luna killed someone, it mattered. Because Avenger killed someone, it mattered. So if you want to level up characters, make sure they kill someone. Okay? And that was a good mission. We got 50 Illyrium, which was the main goal. Now we need more grenades, more ro large rockets, proximity, rifle, smoke grenade, and that. Okay, okay. We, we, will, we, we will restock this ship. Luthias is a sergeant, a vengeance a sergeant, Luna is a sergeant. Going well. Scout died, which we don't care about. Explicit died. So, unfortunately, life goes on. And we have to replace explicit. No, we have to replace two soldiers because Luna is taking a rest. So, the next soldiers up for training is Airborne, Sledgehammer, and Varos. Okay? Actually, we need two scouts. So, we're going to leave Varos and take a scout. We do need two scouts, guys. And we need to put the scout up in front. Okay? And that looks fine for now. Then we just need to make sure everyone's got what they need. We need seven rifles here. We don't have an extra rifle. Interesting. We don't have an extra rifle. We don't have extra rockets. Okay, so let's just check here. We need one rifle. We've got enough rifle rifle clips. We that is good. That is good. We need more large rockets and then the other stuff. Um, we need more large rock. We need one rifle. The storage space is full. Oh, but we can sell a ton of stuff. We can sell a ton of stuff. Okay, alien UFO navigation cell, corpse cell, Illyrium. No, all the plasma pistol clips, all the plasma pistols, all the rifles. We're just keeping heavy plasma guns. That's all we are keeping. Mind probe is worth a lot of money, so I'm going to sell it. It's easy to get another mind probe. Now let's try again. Let's try again. One rifle. There we go. And then large rockets. Yeah. And then grenades. I don't know how many grenades we used, but in any case. Uh, oh, oh, too much, too much. Too much. Uh, six grenades are fine. Proximity, we didn't use any proximity. We didn't use any proximity. So we don't need proximity. We lost one stun rod, according to me. And we've got enough electro flares. Go to base. Okay, so we've got the extra rifle. We've got that got four rockets actually you can't shoot four rockets three is more than enough um we've got 10 grenades we've got 10 smokes don't care about that don't care about that everything is fine we are ready we are ready okay laser pistol laser pistol does more damage than the rifle guys but you are wasting actually if you're not manufacturing every anything you i'll just see what the laser pistol takes to to make it i don't want to waste alien alloys but this is your final research tree on lasers only reason you're researching lasers is to get to laser rifles that's it what does it take to to do this cost per unit eight thousand bucks that's it Okay, well then, then it's fine. Um, if the, if we'll give the scouts two pistols, because then the scouts can you can always carry the stun rods. 
because if you, if you carry something else in your other hand with a rifle you shoot way, way less accurate so we're going to give the scouts the pistols and the stun rods general stores is done go to base now that we've got space we're going to buy two avalanche rockets because we're going to start running into large ufos that needs two avalanche launches each and we need to attack the ship with two interceptors to kill it so we're going to make that we're going to give it 21 rockets this tank's going to run out of rockets soon so we want to give it two more rounds of rockets and that's that basically yeah that's it for the general store that's it for the general store did we buy it did we buy it i don't know if we bought it okay well, i'm not going to manufacture okay there it comes there it comes go to base equipped equip both of these with avalanches Did I buy two launches? What? Didn't I buy two launches? I didn't buy two launches. I need another launcher, bro. I need another avalanche launcher. There. Go to base. Equip craft. I need two la two avalanche launchers. Okay, so now both ships are armed with avalanches, so we sell the poop. We sell this poop, this Stingray launcher poop. And we save a lot of space. Okay, here we go. It's in the sky. Intercepted with the Sky Ranger. Intercepted with the Interceptor. Follow it until it goes too far. One minute. Okay, it landed. It landed. Right. Oh. It is a small one. The thing is, I... It's... Look here, guys. It's going to take a long time. It's going to take a long time for me to wait for daytime. So I have to choose... Do I really want the Illyrium? Or do I want to wait for daytime? Because it can lift off if we wait too long. So we're going to do the mission at night. Let's go. Okay, scout. No! We didn't equip the... Come on, guys. Come on. I told you guys we can't make any mistakes within the first three months. Why didn't you guys tell me to equip the laser pistols? Why didn't you guys tell me to equip the laser pistols? Yeah, yeah, true, 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 true. Okay, now Electro Flares takes priority over everything. Without light, we are blind. Without light, we are blind. He can't carry anything because he's overweight. Avenger take a light. Toro take a light. And then the rest of you, I still want you to use smoke. I still want you to use smoke. I'm going to prime a grenade on you, Airborne, just in case we get into a sticky situation like last time. And Airborne, you've got a lot of strength, so I'm going to give you a big, big butter boom. I'm going to give you a big butter boom. If everything looks bad, you're going to use the big butter boom, okay? If anything looks like it's going haywire, and yeah, you've, you, you've got an arm, like you've got an Airborne arm. You like a, you like like American football play, you know, like you like a quarterback, my bro. You can throw a thing right across the map, so that's very very important. 
But just in case you're blind, I'm gonna give you a flare. Just in case you're blind. Okay, enough, enough, enough now with the smoke grenades. We're not gonna throw smoke grenades everywhere. Sledge, you're also nice and strong. I'm also gonna let you throw stuff around. You can throw proximity around. And you're fine. Although you're very strong, so I might want to give you a better weapon. You're very, very strong, so I might want to give you a better weapon. Who's got the big weapons? Avengers got the one big weapon. Toro's got the other big weapon. But Toro isn't strong enough. Yeah, Toro is not strong enough. Sledge. Yeah, Sledge, you... You, you take this gun, bro. You take this gun. Toro... You take the rifle, my bro. Can't overload you like that. We cannot overload you like that. Um, yeah, I'll take another light if you want. Okay, I think we're happy. It's sad that we didn't take the, the pistols. That's why we crafted the two pistols. But it's fine. Let's go. The night mission is very complicated because you smoke saves your life, but the aliens can see at night like it's daytime. You cannot see at night like it's daytime. So night times gives the aliens a major advantage, but I want the Illyrium because the Illyrium is going to help me to craft ammo that will keep my soldiers alive. So I need to focus on it. So, first things first, we have to throw this outside. Okay, there's a mountain there. Doesn't tell us much. He can't really throw. I'm gonna have to move the tank out. I cannot. I cannot um, risk. I cannot risk it. I have to move the tank out. And whatever I see, I have to kill. Back to the original. Yes, Kelly. The ultimate version. The ultimate version, darling. Okay, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna put the tank here, so that the aliens don't kill me. Okay, um, tank, uh, stand there, okay, I don't know who's going to reaction fire, but I hope no one reaction fires, scout, stand there, scout number two, I think this is the edge of the map. I don't think we have to worry, but in any case, you stand there, and then you throw that there. Okay, there's the UFO. Oh, 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 I don't know. Okay, I don't know where the corner of the map is. That's bad. I don't know where the corner of the map is. Avenger, you stay safe. Guys, we need to cover the commander. Who's got the smoke grenades? Cover the commander immediately. Thank you very much. Okay, you can bring some light on the subject here. Yeah? Throw the light. Okay, we still don't know where the edge of the map is. That's quite dangerous. We know the aliens are coming from that side. Which is also extremely dangerous. I want to move the tank out. Not now. 
I don't know if we covered enough with smoke because if they the problem is guys if they shoot at the scouts and they miss the scouts they can kill the high ranking officers so we we definitely need another smoke out here without a shadow of a doubt we need another smoke out here okay that should be okay i'm not sure it should be okay okay this guy's got a grenade and it's primed oh airborne holy poop holy poop we don't want airborne near anything airborne is a airborne is a freaking maniac let's put airborne here no, we don't want to move airborne out too much. Just cover the commander. Okay. If you get shot... Luth... Move one square. Okay, don't move one square. It's fine. You can't really help at this moment. You cannot help at this moment. Let's close our eyes and hope nothing bad happens. Okay. Now, <clears throat> let's have some fun, man. We have, we're doing a night mission. Let's have some fun. I want Airborne to do what he was born to do. He's still gonna... He, this thing's still gonna explode. But we're gonna prime this thing. Now he's a living nightmare. If he doesn't survive one round, we are all dead. How you guys like that for risk? If this guy dies here, he kills everyone. How you guys like that? You guys like that? Is that exciting? Are you there? Okay. Ruth? It's time to do what we do. It's time to do what we do. But I think... I think that tree's in your way. Just between me and you, boss. I think that tree's in your way. Thirty-eight percent. If you kill everyone, it's tough. It's tough. Okay, we killed the alien. Well done, Luth. Well done. Scout, where's your scout? Wow, how much time units have you got? Okay, your time new units are not going to help us. Your time units are not going to help us. Scout two. Scout two. Prime throw. Okay. If anything moves close to that door, it should die. It should die. Okay, Fabijan, you guys just need to check for me what the, where's the edge of the map? We need to find the edge of the map, boys. We need to find the edge of the map. Avenger. Okay, no, you need Toro. I'm sorry, buddy, but Avenger and me needs to survive here. Avenger, I need you to throw this thing further. I need you to throw this thing way further. Is this the edge of the map? It is the edge of the map. Okay, throw it there then. That's the Avenger. Yeah, you're weak. Oh my word, Avenger. You can't throw to save your life. Goodness gracious. Okay, we need light. We need light. We need... No, we don't need that guy. We don't want that guy to move an inch. We need some light. You've got light. Please give us some light. And stand in front of the commander. Okay, 
Okay, we've got some light. It does really matter because there's smoke there. So we won't see them unless they're on top of us. We won't see them unless they're on top of us. No, stop it. Just select this guy. Thanks. Uh, you... I don't know where you're going to stand. Yeah, you go stand there. And you throw that there. That's it, Sledge. You've got a nice throwing arm on you. I like it. Cody, I don't want to risk your life, buddy, but um, we have to protect this crazy lunatic airborne with our entire life. We have to protect our own lives. Because if this guy dies, we all die. Okay? So, yeah. That's how the cookie crumbles. The tank reaction fired. Holy poop. I've never seen the tank reaction fire. And this is not a small UFO. So I think we're just going to kill these people. I think we are just going to kill this guy. Okay. And now... We have to get this lunatic to throw this thing. And if he doesn't throw it correctly, we're all dead. Is this exciting or what, guys? Is this exciting or what? If he misses, if he throws it here, we're dead. Isn't it scintillating exciting? <laughs> okay the scout was too close how many blocks are is that one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten eleven twelve twelve blocks only poop in the doom school Okay. And you guys thought I was joking. We could have lost the entire team. Okay. Soldiers, I have faith that although we don't know what's in the smoke, <laughs> whatever was there is not there anymore, guys. So the entrance of the UFO is cleared. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Scout, don't cry about your friend. Just keep moving, soldier. And don't walk over the flames because you don't have armor on. Do not walk over the flames. Tank. Cover his butt. You haven't got enough time units. When did you use any time units? In any case. Cody. Okay, airborne. I want you to get rid of this grenade quite soon. Um, priming something beforehand is not that good. And just the fact that I know you can throw wrong, like, you, the guy doesn't always throw where you s tell him to throw. You say throw there, and then he throws here. So, doing what we did there, um, it was exciting, but it's over now. We're not doing that again. The blast radius of it is freaking insane. In freaking insane. Pledge. We need to heat you up a bit, bro. Go stand there at the flames. It's like an action movie. Where you're standing in front of the flames, ready to kick some ass. So, hope you enjoy it. Bobby John, move with Avenger. Pick up the light. Okay. I almost fell off my chair there. I almost fell off my chair there. It is so unfair that these guys can see at night and I cannot see. It's bull. Yo, you can't do anything while you watch this, bro. Oh my word, Fabi John, there's an alien there. You're not going to make it, bro. It doesn't help. Take the light off you. Make it dark. Somebody throw smoke! Toro! My brother from another mother. We need to see this guy. My brother from another mother. If we don't see this guy, Bobby John is dead. 
Bobby Johnny is as dead as Dornell. Toro, just tell me you could throw further than Avenger. For the love of everything that's holy. Where is this guy? Um, Avenger? Save him! Why can't we see him? Scout? Hopefully the scout gets shot in the back. Hopefully the scout gets shot in the back. There's so much smoke here, Flavio. I think you're safe. I think you're safe there, bro. There's so much smoke going on there. If they shoot you there, it's a frigging miracle. Godish. Bro. I'm sorry, bro, but we need heroes. And right now it's you. I'm sorry, bro, but we need heroes. We are in a bad place. Talking about euros. Talking about euros. 43%. 43%. Talking about euros. Where is this frigging guy? Luth. Don't let him die, bro. Don't let him die! You almost killed him! You idiot! Damn it. Okay, never mind. Uh, my nerves are shot. I can't think anymore. I can't think anymore. I can't think anymore. Can we just can we just end the turn, please? Can we, just 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 this end the turn? Ah! Papa John, I tried. I tried, Father John, I tried! We couldn't see him! And I shot my rocket like a banana, my bro. I shot that freaking rocket like a banana, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, buddy, I'm so sorry. Take attack! Oh my word, what's here? Now we have to deal with someone here as well? Okay, no. Tank, attack that. Where is he? There he is. There he is. Okay. Okay, we still have to spot this guy. Scout, your job has just changed. Your job has just changed, my bro. I don't know where this guy is, but you need to spot him like in yesterday. I don't care if you die. Tell me where the freaking alien is. There we go. Toro. Put this guy out of his misery. <laughs> Toro, my brother from another mother. Scout, get back to your position. Avenger, you need to kill something. Now we've got this lunatic over here. We've got this. We've got this freaking quarterback over here. Stop. You, you're using too much time units. Quarterback away! Oh my quarterback! Oh my quarterback! Airborne, my brother from another mother. Check that arm, bro. Check that arm. Okay. Eventually, you need to kill someone, but I don't know how you're going to get a kill, bro. I don't know how you're going to get a kill without risking your life. Um, I think you stay behind the guys here. I think you stay behind the guys. I don't know who else is going to come at us, but this area doesn't feel very safe. I'm going to just put you here so that you can fire at anything at any time. You guys need to equip your stun rods. Equip the stun rods. You guys need to be on overwatch. You are on Overwatch. Okay. Overwatch, Overwatch. Done, 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 done. Go. They're coming. They are coming. Stun rods, activate. He's not looking at you. How much for a stun? How much for a stun? 15 time units. That's not enough. You can't move there. Can you stun him like that? I don't know. 
If you can't stun him like that, you're freaking dead, bro. If you cannot stun him like that, you are freaking dead. That's Cody. We can't let Cody die. Oh, my word. I think you can. I think you can. Cody! I, I'm so glad you trusted me, Cody. I'm so glad you trusted me. Cody, you're in a lot of danger there. Tank, clear the freaking area. Tank, move. Why don't you want to move? Okay. Um, Avenger. Come here. No, you just do reaction fire. Are you hurting? No. Are you hurting? No. Are you hurting? No. No. Everyone's just on Overwatch. Everyone here is just on Overwatch. That's it. Just everyone on Overwatch. Let's see if these two guys can do it. Avenger wants a kill. Okay, Avenger, you go in there as backup. You go in there as backup, but you keep those guys in front of you. I'm sorry, Cody. I knew that was a possibility. My son comments all actions when playing Rocket League with friends. It's super fun for him, like for Luth. I love Luth's enthusiasm. Always put a smile on my face. Nice, Lich. Cody, I'm sorry, bro. Like, you died a hero, bro. That's all I can tell you. You died a hero. We needed a hero. You were a hero. Okay, well, Scout's dead. Scout is as dead as a door now. We need, we need backup. We need backup. Um, you know what guy? What 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 guy loves killing stuff? Definitely this guy. This guy loves killing stuff. Airborne, let's go. Flavio, let's go. Sledge, let's go. Who else? Toro. I don't know, Toro. Stay right there. Tank. Make sure we're clear. He didn't come out. He didn't come out. That's going to be his mistake. That's going to be his mistake. That's what should have happened with Cody. That's what should have happened with Cody. Okay, he got hurt. That's fine. That's fine. What? Stun! Thank you. Uh, okay, that guy's gonna die. Avenger, I need to keep you alive. You go there. Sledge. Prime. How much do you need to throw it? 13 time units. That's not enough. Okay, well, I'll just keep you outside. Avenger? I keep you here as well. Okay. Tank, search the rest of the field. Okay, let's go. Scout's dead. It happens. It happens. It happens. Now, let them pay. Let them pay for it. Let them pay for it, Flavio. Let them pay for it, Flavio. Throw. There we go. Now, Avenger, you can't die, bro. Do not worry. You cannot die. According to me. Flavio is going to die. All right? If someone dies, Flavio is going to die. But if he shoots through Flavio, then you're going to die. So let's just move you here. 
Okay. Okay, no one can move there. Guys. Let's go. Why don't you guys come out on the other side, man? Come on. Sledge, I don't know what to tell you, bro. I don't know what to tell you. Holy shit, Avenger almost died. Avenger, get out of here. Alien dies as this though. Yeah, I know. That was just for the reaction shots. That was just for the reaction shots. Okay, we got Illyrium again. Avengers alive. That's good. Avenger went to Captain. We lost. We lost the two scouts, Fabijan, Cody, and Flavio. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We need the living quarters real soon. Purchase soldiers. <clears throat> we need 30 soldiers to level up properly. Now we can have 30 of that. Wait. What? I built two living quarters. Oh, money. Money. I just wanted to say, what the heck, bro? I built two living, living quarters. Stuff the mine probes. We've got the two laser pistols, remember that. Now, purchase. Twenty scientists. Ten engineers. Okay, alien containment is done. The soldiers are in. Okay. Let's get back to the action. This is a scout. This is Matthias. Rudolf. Very strong soldier. Okay, we have to go up the list. Did I miss anyone? Did I miss anyone? Well, Victor became a soldier. Kelly still needs to become a soldier. Did we miss anyone? Okay, well, Sergey's here now. Sergey. 
so that one's gonna be Sir Jay. That's all right, soldier Hamza. We're gonna bring everyone back to life. X, listen. Only people who can't get brought back to life. Okay, no new new people in the chat. Ninja. If you guys want to be the team, type in the chat. If you guys want to be the team, type in the chat. Adrian is going to be Sotos. Sotos. Jules is going to be Kelly. I don't know. No, we're going to make it a scout. Those stats aren't good enough for Kelly. These stats are fantastic. Holy poop. We're going to make that blue. We're going to make that blue. Tesfa. Tesfa. Is that, a, is that a woman? I hope that's a woman. Kelly. Uh, you're not impressive. You're a scout. You're scared, you're a scout. Fari. Mm. It is back from the dead. Yes, she is. Okay, if you died, please say your name. If you died, please say your name. Ranjit. Very good soldier. Who died? Who died? Who died? Who died? I killed Explicit first. Explicit was the first to go. Who was the second to die? Who was the second to die? Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Quick, quick, quick. Who was the second to die? I think Fabi John was the last person to die. Maybe Fabi John was the second person to die. Fabi John was the second person to die. Flavio, okay. The dead don't talk, bro. Georgie! Uh, okay. Uh, I don't know, man. No, Scout. He can't shoot to save his life. He can't shoot to save his life. He's scared, Michelle. She's scared. Scout. Lean. Okay, we're going to give this to Georgie. Okay. Cat B is scared. Carsten, gonna make you... There, we got it, Carsten. You're in, buddy, you're in. That's it. The openings are closed, guys. The openings are closed. Okay. Equip craft. We need the laser pistols. Laser pistols, too. For the scouts. Okay, then we need a few more. Need a few more smoke, proximity, and stun. Smoke, proximity, and stun. Stun. Proximity. Smoke. More large rockets. More. More. And more rifle clips. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, Avengers wounded, he survived, so that's fine. Luna Dark is fine again. Okay, so Luna's back. We need two scouts. Scout one. And then whatever, scout two. Okay, scout two. And then it's Baros, Sam, Victor. Sky Ranger. Interceptor. Again, it's going to take long for... I don't want to do nighttime missions, guys. We're losing too many people on nighttime missions. Ah, uh, whatever. Whatever. What the heck? Okay, now. Car Ranger, select your target, go. Okay. I fly every time around to wait the suns come up. Yeah, but sometimes, yeah, yeah, like, sometimes they left off. Like, if you're at the beginning of nighttime, it's difficult. If you're close to the end of night, it's okay. Exercise caution. There may be operatives in the UFO or around the crash site, whatever. Okay, Scout is weak. Give him the pistol. Give him the stun rod. Give him... No, not, don't give him the stun rod now. Don't give him the stun rod now. First, give him the freaking smoke. Give him the smoke. And give him a grenade. Okay? And give him that. Okay. You the other Scout. Give you the smoke, give you the stun, give you the grenade, give you the proximity. You guys was going to the UFO. I'm losing way too many people in the UFO. Way too many people in the UFO. I don't like it. Matthias is ready for action. Taro is ready for action. Okay, we don't need the lights anymore. Uh, Taro can take a smoke. Or I could take a grenade. Yeah, she can she can do that. Airborne. Okay, airborne survived a lot, so I think I'm just gonna give airborne the big gun. I think I'm just gonna give airborne the big gun. You've got a big gun. You don't have extra ammo. It's fine. You can get a smoke as well. A rush. You get a rifle with a rifle clip. With a grenade. With that. I'd like you to prime the grenade, but not right now. Actually, you know what? Prime it right now. And take the stun gun. And since you can, take an extra good night. Sam, you get a magazine, you get that, you get that, you're gonna do it, and then you get that. Here we go. Victor, you get a gun, you get the stun rod, you get a grenade, and you get a smoke. You need a big gun and something to throw. You got a big gun and you've got something to throw. Oh my word. Three aliens.
If he shoots, they shoot. If he shoots all three of them, they've got all their time units, guys. They've got all their time units. If he shoots, they shoot. If I throw a smoke grenade, they shoot. If I move, they shoot. Hallelujah. Oh! oh, baby. Oh, man. All right. Take that, aliens. They didn't use a didn't lose a single unit, baby. Where's the where's the UFO? Hey, scout, I want you to see. That if this, if you shoot this guy, does you shoot back? That's all. I just don't want a reaction shot on the leaders. So you test if he gets angry when you hit him. Just test it for me quickly. Okay, he gets very angry when you shoot him. He gets very angry with it when you shoot him. Thanks. Thanks, Scout. Appreciate it, buddy. I appreciate it, bro. You're my hero. You're my hero, Scout. You're my hero. You're my hero, bro. Thank you, Tank. You told me someone's in there. Thanks a lot. Matthias, do what you do. Yep. That is, that is more or less what you do, Luth. That's more or less what you do, buddy. Freaking unbelievable. Unbelievable. Mm. Faro, 
Can you can you do what you did now now again? Can you do what you did now now again? Please, bro, I need you. I need you, Toro. I need you. Please do what you just did. Um, how much for an auto? 18 time units. But you're gonna take one time unit to look that way as well. Yeah, I'll go there. You're gonna take one time unit, two time units, okay? Now you're gonna auto him. Toro! Toro, Toro, Toro. Okay. Luna. Luna, there's someone in here. One scout's already dead. Hopefully this alien just shoots the tank. But Luna, that's the corner of the map, Luna. I think you'll be fine, Luna. I think I need you to do a tactical move. I hope you're fine. Yeah, Luna, you're fine. You're fine, you're fine, fine. Okay, next on the list is Airborne. Airborne has got a prime grenade. How long? 14 time units. No, he's gonna have to look that way. No, he's gonna have to look that way. Gonna have to look that way. Can you, can you, can you do it? Tank, can you look in there? Thank you, Tank. Um, airborne. Oh, <gasps> you haven't primed it? I thought you primed it, bro. No, man, I thought you primed it for Pete's sake. Not enough time units. What a waste. What a waste. Why didn't we prime it? I don't think that's going to save us. Did you prime this one? You. 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 You primed it. Okay. You primed it. Okay. But you now, now it's useless. Now it's useless. You can never throw this. You can never throw this. 18. How much to throw? 15. Can you throw, Baros? Can you throw? I really, really hope so. No. No. Oh, he passed out. He passed out. He passed out. Baros, my champ. He passed out. Cover the soldiers, cover the soldiers, cover the soldiers. There we go. What just happened? Out of the five targets in front of me, he shoots me. I had five decoys. I had five decoys that are closer than me. Okay, well. Technically, we failed, guys. Technically, we failed. But th that guy. The tank. That guy. Okay, we didn't have people very close. The, the tank should have moved closer. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Did 
Did we ever move Luna? Did we remember to move Luna? I'm sure we lo moved Luna. I'm sure we moved Luna. But in any case, it's fine. Uh, I could I could have covered I could have covered myself better. I could have covered myself better. There wasn't enough people. But I mean, where where are we gonna get you a shot from? You know, like we thought that thing was clear, but it's fine, guys. Fine, let's move on. Vice dead. It's over. Um. Everyone, check this for me. Where is the spaceship? I would think the spaceship is here. I would think so. Or just, I think Luna can see everything, but just make sure for me, please. Just make sure for me there's no one in there. Thank you. Sad man, sad. Victor, just check the perimeter for me, please. Thanks. Oh, Victor, you found the ship. Okay. Sam, help Victor cover the area. Thanks a lot, buddy. You guys can clear this. We're gonna go for the UFO. Scouts, where are you? Where's the scouts? Where are the scouts? Scout, you should have stood closer there, but it's fine, bro. Where's the other scout? How many people have we lost? Two. Was that the other scout? Okay. Luna, I want you to get on this roof. I want you to clear this roof. Victor says, send me in. Send you in. Victor, you want to go in? Slayer, I want you to cover this area. Best way for you to cover the area is to get onto the roof. Or just kill this guy. <laughs> Slade, you got hurt. I'm very sorry, but I had to save your life. You did you did get hurt, bro, but it's fine. Okay? I couldn't afford to move you backwards. He could have reacted fire you when you moved backwards. Okay? I had to take the shot. I knew I, I knew you were, would get hurt, but still, we had to take the shot, bro. We had to take the shot. I'll let you get shot in the back, man, bro. No one's getting shot in the back, yeah. Airborne, you've still got a prime grenade. You still have a prime your freaking grenade. Airborne, just for that. You're going to the UFO. Barosh. Uh, you need to do what... You need to do what Sledge was going to do. Sledge needs to rest. He's very badly hurt. Okay, Varos. I need you to get onto this roof. Where's the stairs? Okay. Tank. Do your job. Where's the door? The door's on the other side. It's gracious.
Okay, advance. The tank will protect you. Victor, you're going in with a scout, bro. You're going in with a scout. Okay, Sledge, you just check the perimeter for me, bro. You just check the perimeter for me. Mm, somebody needs to check this, these bushes. But not now. Luna. You need to get into this roof. And then get to a window for me, please. Please get to a window for me. They're all the apple trees, Toro. They could be hiding hiding behind the apple tree, bro. Make sure you cover all the apple trees. Okay. Sledge looks fine here. Yeah, I just want you to take a break here, buddy. Take a knee, take a break. You get onto the roof. Luna, get it to the window. Is there fluff flames there, Luna? We'll check if you get hurt the next turn. I don't want you to stand on flames. You know what? I don't know if there's flames there, but let's make a new hole for you, shall we? Let's make a new hole for you. There we go. Okay, now you can see Luna, so it's fine. Okay. Aliens are starting to move. You get into position, get onto your knees. We need to save Sledge. We need to save Sledge. We are not losing a soldier for nothing. This is the edge of the map, Toro. I think we're clear. I think the only aliens are in there. Boys, it's time to shine. It's time to shine. Where's the scouts? Scout. Check what's inside. Okay, it's very, very open. You stand there. Don't worry, bro, you can't die. Not if the scout's standing there. If the scout's standing there, you won't die. Do not worry. Okay, that's it. Scout, get ready. Let's see if he's going to get angry, Scout. Okay, I have to hit. Okay. Sledge, we saved you, bro. I don't know what to say. That was bad. We need to fill up the soldiers.
Uh, get about four extra soldiers. You know, get seven. We're going to keep losing soldiers. Just get seven extra soldiers. It's fine. Let's sell some equipment that we got. We didn't get any Illyrium. Because we shot the UFO down, we didn't get any Illyrium, which is very, very, very bad. That's why I don't like shooting UFOs down. Thought Toro taught me that. He taught me that. I definitely want to craft things very, very fast. Okay, we got this laser rifles. Now we stop with rifle training. Now we stop with rifle training. Next one is alien alloys. Hey, Wumble Boss. And we make seven rifles. How much does it take? Uh, it just costs money. That's fine. We make seven laser rifles. Okay, we just wait for the soldiers to come in. We add the engineers. Now everything's going to speed up really, really fast. Now we're gaining momentum. It's just sad that we lost our commander. Oh, we lost me. But anyway, guys, let me think, let me think, let me think, let me think. Soldiers. Mm, he's not impressive. He's going to be a scout. He's a little bit too scared. Scout. Yeah, good firing accuracy, but a little bit too scared. Brave. One ball, boss. Here we come. Why don't you make laser pistols to sell? It costs you 8k to make. Yeah, I don't do the. I don't do that, buddy. Like, I just keep it real with selling the stuff that I get from the UFOs. And I'm going to be crafting a lot of stuff. That's a cool character. We need to give him a name. Okay, who else died? Flavio died. Flavio died. I like that character. Flavio died. Um, this is Scout. Who else died? Speak now forever. Hold your peace. He's very... I don't know. Uh, Scout. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, I want to be in the game, guys. Toro loves me. He will, for he will forgive me. Toro will have no problem with this. I want to be in the game. Okay, that's it. Let's go. Janice comes in, Nico Boy comes in. Okay. Our first terror mission. Please let it be during the day. Please let it be during the day. I beg you, let it be during the day. No, it's not going to be during the day. This is going to be terrible. If you if you wait at all, the terror mission disappears, guys. If you wait at all, the terror mission disappears. Oh my word, this is bad. This is bad. This is very, very, very bad. Very, very, very bad. Proximities are useless. Proximities are useless in terror missions. You see, Airborne, I, I really want you to blow everything apart. Yeah. Hey, Born, I'm going to need you to do the stupid things. I'm going to need you to do really, really stupid things here. Yeah. Like, pathetically stupid things, my bro. Okay, who's going out? The scouts. The scouts are going out. Prime their grenades. Prime the things. Okay, he's going to throw one. And who's going to throw the other smoke? Who the heck's going to throw the other smoke? You. And you. And you. Okay. Let's go. I hope you are. I hope you are, buddy. I hope you are. This is going to be terrible.
If that's fine, we've got one light. One light's fine. One light's fine. One light's fine. We've still got the tank. We've still got the tank. We are covered. If we die now, there's nothing we can do about it. These guys are really, really close to us. Or let me say this guy is really, really close to me. Where's the edge of the map? I don't know where the edge of the map is. Okay, there's two guys very close to me. Holy poop. Holy smokes, that guy stuff. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, 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 thank you. Okay, bro, I just want, I just need a, I need a, I need a, I need to throw you. I need to throw you. No, you don't have it on you, Sam. Get back to the spaceship. Okay, never mind. Just stand there. Stand there. Smoke. I think we should be fine with the smoke. I think we should be fine with the smoke. Just for extra cover. Just for extra cover. Okay. Wait, is there no one left in the spaceship? Okay. Glory, glory, hallelujah. My DJ with the ruler. Loot is better at being stupid. Definitely. Smoke beam. Always that guy that goes with mutants. The, it's, a, it's a mutant. It's a strong guy. It's a tough guy. It's a tough guy. Thank you. That's your job going. Okay, needless to say, there's a lot more things for us to kill. Needless to say. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we need some lights on the subject. If you can help us get a little, a little bit more lighting here. Thank you very much, Scout. Um, although you do need to move that way. Because if someone dies, it's going to be you. Thank you very much. Scout, you need to give us more light this side. Throw here. Thank you very much, Scout. If anyone dies, it's going to be you, buddy. Tank, you need to give me more vision here. But first, I need to do what I need to do. And that's like an aimed shot so that I don't miss. And we destroyed all the lights. Well done, Uthias. You just took out all the lights. You are a freaking genius. Let's get the place illuminated again. Sorry about that for Ross. I forgot about that. This is hectically dangerous. Hectically dangerous. You could boy stay in the smoke. You, new Luna, stay in the smoke. Airborne, get to the tank. Baros, just get a nice position. Matthias, get to a place where you can fire on more things. Uh, who else? Who else? Victor? You already said you're not scared of anything. Sam? Just get away from the spaceship. Janice? Let's, let's just spread out, guys. Let's just spread out. If an alien grenade... If an alien grenade comes, we're all dead. We are all frigging dead. Press the lens as well. Press the lens are really dangerous. Okay, guys, there's a lot of hostages dying. Can we protect one hostage, please? Just one. Can we please protect one hostage, please? I'll appreciate it. Oh my word. Luth? Luth, where are you? Hmm. Um, we've got a problem. We've got a big, big problem. We've got a big, big, big problem. There's too many walls. There's too many walls. Scout, run for your life. Airborne, if you could do this, if you could do this, I'll be amazed. I will be so amazed. No. 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 How about yeah? 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 No, how about yeah? The human's gonna die. Yes, I know the human's gonna die. How about yeah? How about yeah? Okay, now all of us are gonna die. Never mind. Just 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 stay there. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine.
Okay, at least you removed some cover. I have to give you that. At least you removed some cover. That was worth a try. I'm very sorry, Nico boy. I'm very sorry, bro. Everything's going to poop in a handbag now. Everything is going to poop in a handbag now. This guy can't throw to save his life. Oh, Sam. You tell how strong are you? How strong are you? 28, that's too little. One of us can hit. If just one of us can hit a shot. Well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No, you can't. How much do you need for a shot? 31 time units. Victor, I'm sorry. It was needed. Okay, sacrifices were made. Sacrifices were made. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, now he's shooting hostages. <laughs> Whose bright idea was it to activate a high explosive nuke on airborne? Please, just tell me whose idea was that? Out, you need to get on the freaking space shop! Get everyone on the freaking space ship! I don't care if you see the guy. Run for your life! Okay, you might die. You might die. No, you, you won't. Oh, you're unconscious. Just get on the spaceship. Just get on the spaceship. Get on the spaceship. Get on the spaceship! This is just you two. Did we leave anyone behind? No. Okay. Get out of here. Luna is now the caller now. We lost Matthias, Airborne, Varos, Sam, Victor, Janice, and Nico Boy. Why? Because our commander sucks. Boop! Balls! <laughs> With his decision making. Oh no, we already did the rifles. Oh no, we already we already did the rifles. Cancel. Stop that. Okay. Bases. Okay, wait, let's see get for the soldiers to come in. Okay, we got the personal armor. Let's research the personal armor. How much does it cost? I don't have money. I don't have a lot of money left. Like we always need alien alloys. We always need alien alloys. Now, uh, it just costs three thousand bucks. Okay. Let's spend a hundred grand on that. A oh, hundred grand. Okay. okay. Sam. Guys, please tell me if you died. I know everyone died. Just tell me if you died. I think Kelly died. Sledge. Sledge wants nice things, but us. 
by ideally i don't know guys i don't know who died i do not die i can't remember who died except everyone i think everyone died bobby john Oh, you're alive. You're oh, yeah, you're sick. You're sick. Yeah, you're sick. Flavio, Flavio, are you dead? Oh, we're dying a lot. We're doing dying a lot. I don't know. We lost, man. You guys have to help me. Did you die or not? Airborne. Of course you died. You detonated the freaking... You detonated the thing. Benzineto. I don't know. Arroz. Yeah, Soto, Sotos. And of course, Toro. We have to bring Toro back. Eva. Eva, I think Trinity died. I'm almost sure Trinity died. I'm not sure. I'm not sure Trinity died. Is Trinity sick? Trinity sick. I don't know. I don't know. Is Trinity in the sick bay? I don't know. Janice. Janice died. You didn't die. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay, uh, Sotos didn't die. Sotos didn't die. I'm getting confused. Yeah, you, ha you haven't been on a mission yet. Let's go. Scout, scout, scout. Um, Bobby John. There's a Fabi John. Is there another Fabi John? Why did I? Why do I think I saw two Fabi Johns? There's a Fabi John. There's another Fabi John. Womble, Womble died. I'm sure you died. No, you no, no, we've got two of you. Victor, I'm sure Victor died. I'm getting so confused here. Okay, we might have repeated a few names, but it's fine. Emeron, Trinity, Corsten, Georgie, Fabijan, Explicit. Okay. We don't need the rifles anymore, according to me. Of course, we've got the laser rifles now. Okay, we've still got four rockets. We've got heat seeking. Oh, we've got the auto cannon. We've got the other cannon. We just need an auto cannon. We need an auto cannon. We need a lot of stuff. We need a lot of stuff. We need an. We need this tank. We don't have enough money. 
Uh, I should have thought about that. I should have thought about that. Uh... Desperate time scores, desperate measures, but that isn't even going to be enough, bro. That isn't even going to be enough. Do we need an auto cannon? I don't know. We need 10 grenades. We need 10 of this. We need 10 of that. We need one of that. We need 10 of this. We need 20 of this. We need more large rockets. We need more of that. Need more of that. Okay. And if we really look for something to sell, we can sell the rifles, sell the rifle clips, sell the armor piercing ammo, sell the small rockets, and that's it. Guys, we, we saved the Sky Ranger. That's 500,000. Okay, we, we, we saved the Sky Ranger. That is a lot of money. Okay, if we had to buy a Sky Ranger, that's 500k. We saved the Sky Ranger and Luna. Okay, that's worth something. That's worth something. We don't have a rocket launcher. Hubert. We don't have a rocket launcher. Okay, lesson learned. We never prime a high explosive unless we know we can make the throw. Unless we know we can make the throw. It's a it's it's an easy mistake to make, guys. Anyone can make that mistake. I'm lying. I'm lying, but uh, whatever. Okay, we're equipped. We're equipped. We're equipped. We're just waiting for the tank. We're just waiting for the tank. Now we need money again. Okay, we're going to research Illyrium. There's no, there's no way we've got enough money for this. There's no way. We know 220k. How much have we got? We need 220k. There's no way we can get 220k. There's no way we can get 220k. Okay, we got 220k. Okay. And we got the tank. Okay. We did okay. Although we lost the, the terror mission, we did okay. It could have been way worse. So USA and Canada is very happy. Russia is unhappy. We did okay. It could have been 20 times worse. And the sun is coming. The sun is coming. So we're just going to follow it. The sun is coming. Please land. Please land, because I want everything you have on you. Please land. There we go. 
No, don't start the mission. Sky Ranger, just patrol. And then we can easily wait until daytime. There we go. Sky Ranger. Um, go. Illyrium in the bank. Illyrium in the bank. Okay, so every scout gets a rifle. That's a major upgrade. Gets you gets that. Gets that. Gets that. And gets that. You get a laser rifle, that makes them extremely strong. Scouts are way, way stronger with this. Way, way, way stronger with this. Mm, and you get a smoke. Prime. And take another one. Okay. We don't need the lights anymore. Luna, you're strong. You're very strong. I don't know. I think it's time for you just to blow everything away. Uh, that's a little bit heavy for you. But wait, what if you remove the two grenades? That's fine. Okay. Matthias, you're strong. Okay, wait. Sorry, Luna. I don't know Matthias was strong as well. Luna, you can take this. Okay. You can go crazy with that. Thais, you're going to blow everything away. Cameron, you're not very strong. Take a smoke. And you're going to take this. No, that's fine. Trinity is not even a woman. Please, guys, please remember me, Trinity is not a woman. We need to change her name. Please remind me, Trinity is not a woman. We need to change her name ASAP. ASAP. Austin, you are strong. And uh, that just means I'm going to put a lot of items on you. Okay, I'm not priming any any explosives beforehand ever again. Georgie is a woman. Okay, Georgie and Trinity needs to swap. Georgie and Trinity needs to swap. Take notes, guys. Take notes. Georgie and Trinity needs to swap places You know what? I'm not in the mood to, mood to waste time. Let's go.
That looks like the right coverage. That does look like the right coverage. We are basically covered. We are basically covered. Okay, guys, I'll be back now. Gonna get a glass of juice. I'll be back now. Yeah, I'm back, I'm back, that's last week. I rewinded the stream and saw it. Not gonna lie, that was kind of funny. Mm -hmm. I had a high explosive prime. Then Reaver bit me and dropped the high explosive. Okay, let's end the turn. Perfect. Yeah, kill it. It's fine. No, don't kill us! Georgie, okay. Okay, Luna needs to become a man, remember that. No, Trinity, Trinity needs to become a man. We can't swap Trinity with Georgie anymore. I repeat, we cannot swap Trinity with Georgie anymore. Where are the scouts? Just sit down, please, before you hurt yourself. <laughs> Thank you, Luna. Thank you for being a great example. I'm a freaking idiot. Is this grenade primed? No, it's not. Okay. Mm, we need to see more. We need to see more. There's an alien inside there. There's definitely an alien inside there. We need... We need a proximity. We need a proximity. You've got two little time units. Don't you have a proximity? But you have to swap. Okay, we need someone that doesn't need to swap. Okay.
Okay. Uh, scout, you're a little bit too close, buddy. Scout. Boston. Uh, Trinity. You guys stay there. Explicit. Bobby John. Just split, just split up, just split up. That's all I want. <laughs> who, who killed that guy? Who on earth did, did such great reaction fire? Yo, that was brilliant. Okay, but that's not that's not it. That's not it. Okay, that's not it. Careful, Fabio John. That isn't it. Careful, guys. It's not over. It's not over. Split up. Split up. Split up. Split up. Just get into a good position to cover everyone. You guys move this way. just died we need vision of that trinity we need vision thank you trinity this guy's flying this guy's flying luna you don't really miss Christina. okay that was a difficult shot never mind Austin, you got this, you got this, you got this. Don't worry about the ammo, it's infinite. That guy stuff. Papa John. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. Okay, Luna. I need you guys to move closer. Although you can't move closer, okay. I just need you guys to know what's the heck's going on here. Trinity got hit. Okay, so there's someone there, but there's someone here as well. There's someone here as well. There's someone here as well. I heard it. I heard it. Where are you? You're in here. I know you're in here. Damn it. I know you're in there. Trinity, we need to see this guy. All of them are freaking flying. You know what, Trinity? Break his... Break him. Okay, Trinity is fine. Okay, lose. 92%, bro. If you miss this, I don't know. Okay, there's someone in there, guys. There's someone in the freaking... The one behind the tree. Trinity with auto cannon. The, there's someone in the UFO. Cameron. There's someone in the UFO, my bro. Scout. Yeah, whatever. Make sure no one's here. Just make sure. I think there's someone in the UFO. What is that? Oh, no. Oh, Scout just became unconscious. How did he become unconscious? No, it's just a door closing behind me. It's just a door closing behind me. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Scout, clear the rooms. 
Okay, never mind. There's there's more aliens here somewhere. There's more aliens here somewhere. This guy's wait. What the heck? Okay, we're still not done. We're still not done. Okay. Now I'm confused. Okay, you just do that. Um, I don't think there's anyone in that UFO anymore. I really don't think there's anyone. Let me at him. <laughs> Into position. You guys need to fire on anything that is seen. Yeah, okay. It's not the UFO. It's not the UFO. Someone is here. Someone is here. I don't think it's in here. Trinity? Do you see another one? Um, Luna is the commanding officer, so give her a chance. Okay. He softened. He is softened. Okay, Trinity, now you take the shot. Take the shot. Okay. You guys opened up everything for us. Thank you very much. You guys have opened up everything for us. You did well. Carsten said, let me at him. Carsten, kill this. Thing. Okay, Carsten, get a scope on that gun, please. Please put a scope on that gun. Something's wrong with it. Check it when we get to base. It's defective, bro. It's defective. Just check it when we get to the base, please. No, it didn't hit any no it didn't hit anything no you destroyed everything around the target bro that's about it okay um you need to get in here but you can't get in there okay have we got anyone left get back we've got you I don't know why you put the rock launcher there, but in any case. Rook, the camera on, just check behind us. I don't trust this. I don't trust this. Someone's flying. Someone's clearly flying. I just don't know where. I think Fabi John is in deep, deep poop. Deep poop. Trinity, I don't know. I don't know, Trinity. I, we don't see anyone. Someone is somewhere. We just don't see him because of all this flip and smoke. You guys just... You guys stay on Overwatch. This guy's moving around. This guy's moving around. Just... Just check everywhere for me, please. This guy's definitely moving around. Not in there not here okay bro you need to help trinity you need to help trinity okay we see him he's in there okay trinity uh trinity i need you to just remove the cover i just need you to remove the cover that's all i want you to do Okay, you remove the bed of the cover. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Uh, 
How much do you need for an aim shot? 38 time units. Okay. Okay, now you aim shot at him. There we go. Tank, we need another tank and we need three smoke grenades. We need another tank and Luna became the commander, guys. Luna has become the commander. The highest ranking officer. Well done. Well done. Georgian explicit is dead. Okay. Um, we need a tank. We need a tank. We need... What was it? Smoke grenades. I can't remember. And then we need to equip the craft with more soldiers. We still got both scouts left, but one scout is wounded, so we need another scout. Avenger is still not in back in action. Avenger is still not back in action. Okay. Sledgehammer is still not back in action. So it's Kelly. Sotos, no. No, 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 no. Sorry, Sotos. Not yet. We need the tank. We need space for the tank. Okay, we don't have enough personal armor yet. Let's just wait. We got the smoke grenade. We got the rockets. We got the tank. Okay, equip craft. We need a tank. Okay. We got the Illyrium. Um, now it's UFO power source first. Change name for Trinity. Thanks, thanks, buddy. Thanks, thanks. Okay. Bases, soldiers. We have another Trinity. No, we don't have another Trinity. But Trinity is not a woman. Is there a Toro? Is there a Toro? No. Trinity becomes Toro. Toro was the hero in any case. Good, the sun is coming. The sun is coming. Please land. No, no. Land. No, just follow him. Follow him. Follow him. We need him to land. The sun is coming up. The sun is coming up. Land. Land. Oh my word. What? Damn, he landed. Fantastic. Okay, scout. You're perfect. Scout. How many scout did we bring three scouts what okay whatever whatever Okay, we need to change Kelly. We need to change Kelly into a woman. That's the edge of the map. 
so we have to go this way Well done, Scout. Yeah, you gotta be kidding me. That's a tough bugger. Everybody moves, he doesn't shoot. Okay, it's the one who hits him. It's the one who hits him that makes him react. It's the one who hits him that makes him react. But how did he survive that? How did he survive a high explosive round? Okay. That's sad, guys. That's sad. But any case. That was sad. He probably had one HP left. Yeah, I don't know. High explosive round. I don't know, but it was. It was. I mean, there's a lot of things that went wrong there. Just the fact that he hit that shot is already very unlucky. You know, just the fact that he hit the shot was very unlucky. A lot of things was unlucky, but I mean, him reacting and doing a perfect shot is bad. Show me where they are. Thank you. Get out of my way. Thank you. Get out of my way. Thank you. Now die. Yeah, oh. no, survive that. Survive that. Where's the scouts? Where's the scouts? Come, come, come. Do your job. Do your jobs. Do your jobs. Tank. Do your job. Kelly, shoot the living poop out of this guy. Well done, Kelly. Camera on. Move in. Kelly, get a better angle of all the angles that you could be covering. Uh, guys, I think this is clear. I think this area is clear. Let's move this way. I don't think anything's gonna get us over there. 
Okay, Fabijan, I want you behind. Want you behind that scout. And Tara, I want you behind everyone. But just split up so that a grenade doesn't kill all of us. Cameron, I don't want you to move forward now. Not yet. Not yet. I want you to clear this area. Now, clear this area, please. If there's someone there, okay, just make sure there's no one there. The rest of you, we're gonna flank around this side. We are gonna flank around this side. Let's go. That's clear. Get onto high ground. Get onto high ground. Okay. Get down on a knee. Scout 2, cover his back. If someone appears from here, just cover him. Okay, now we've got Scout, where's the Scout 3? Where's the other Scout? There we go. Scout, go see if you spot someone. Everyone, follow the Scout. Thanks down, thanks down. Redirect, redirect, redirect. Throw some smoke here that you don't die. Okay, now use the smoke. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh Tara, I'll feel safe if you if you cover them. Okay, the rest of you moving. Smoke covered you guys perfectly. Now move in. Hey, get some cover. Abhijan, you need cover. No, you can't use that cover. Use this cover. You scout, you're just wasting your time here. You scout, you're wasting your time. Come, let's go.
Cost it, I need you to throw a grenade in there. I need you to throw a grenade in there. Now I need you to pray. I think that guy can walk until there and kill you. No, he could. No, he can't. No, he can't. Relax, 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 relax. Okay, uh, get your stun rod. How much for the stun? Fourteen. Time unit. Good. He's got a lot of time units. No one. Okay. They don't want to come out. Okay, you don't want to come out? I'll come in. Now! Okay, whatever. Okay, he's in there. He's in there. He's in there. According to me, he's in there. He's not in here. Oh, my word, he's outside. Oh, my freaking word. How? How the map is so small? Where the heck is he hiding? Where is he hiding? In here somewhere. That's all I can think of in the mountains. Guys in the mountains. We need another tank. We need one smoke grenade. The scout is becoming a colonel. Oh my word. Luna and Toro. The tank is way too expensive, but we've got things to sell. We've de we'll definitely have things to sell. Mm. 
We've already got 200 Illyrium. That's great. That's great. And we, we're we getting more heavy plasma so that we don't have to craft them when we research the plasmas. And our money isn't a problem anymore. Use four more scouts than a tank. That's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. But I'm used to playing like this. Okay, we better start using people. There's a lot of people that haven't even had a chance to play. Let's start using people here. Um, scout and scout. Okay, we need another scout. No, we don't need another scout. No, we don't need another scout. Um, we only need two scouts. Okay, scout, scout, Luthias, Sledgehammer's wounded, Sotos, Ninja Nier. Ninja Nier. Since when did we? Okay. Zerg. Okay. Personal armor. Okay, I want to make alien, alien alloys. Give me a hundred. You know what? Give me two hundred. Okay. Mm -hmm. Power suits. There we go. Better armor, guys. Better armor. Better armor. And now UFO navigation. UFO navigation. I'm going straight for the for the flying suits. I'm not getting the power suit. I'm going straight for the flying suits. Very small. No, I don't want to play with very small UFOs. Okay, you got away. Large! Here we go, guys. Here we go. Just got back from work where I was watching as well and heard my name. What did I set on fire? No, you're in the mission now, bro. Okay, now we have to attack this with both interceptors. Both interceptors. Damn it! Can I just get one, please? Why are they on the edge like this? Come on, man. Get them. We can't catch them. Okay, never mind. Another one. We lost that one as well. Okay. You have a construction. Wait. Where's the flying suit? Why am I not getting the flying suit? UFO construction?
Good. Finance is good. Okay. Maybe we should craft something here. No, not now. Not now. Okay. Ah, another large one. Come on, man. Let me blow this thing out of the sky. Let me blow this thing out of the freaking sky. Don't fly away. Go, 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 go. Go. Stop. Oh, there we go. The next one. Yes! Not, not in the water. Oh, shit. He landed in the water. Oh, he landed in the water. In any case, that's how you take down a large UFO, Gus. Um, I'm sad he landed in the water, but that's how you take down a large UFO. You need two interceptors, both with avalanche missiles. Or the plasma beam. Plasma beam, we're going to research later. New flying craft. What am I missing here? Is the is the flying suit after the power suit? Is the flying suit after the power suit? Maybe. Maybe the maybe it's after the power suit. Because we've got everything we need for the for the flying. Flying suit. There we go. 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 Flying suit. This is the best armor in the game, guys. After this, we go for the best. Um, I don't know how much is it to manufacture. After this, we go for the best gun in the game, which is the heavy plasma. Cross five Illyrium. No, 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 no. Very small. Go blow it out of the sky. It's escaping. Load out of the sky. Come on! You peeing. You are. You are. You are upsetting me now. Okay, never mind. Not enough avalanche missiles. Oh my word! Really? What, what? What did you say? Not enough story space. What the heck are we storing, bro? What the heck are we storing? We're not storing a lot of things. Okay, well. Then, uh... Laboratory. Workshop. Living quarters. Not enough. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Holy poop, bro. You want to tell, tell me this alloys alien, alien, alien will take you so much space? Okay, best armor in the game. Best armor in the game. Now we go for the best gun in the game. And now we make the best armor in the game.
17 days okay okay we can't we have to wait for that so what we're gonna do is we're gonna equip the soldiers what the for well, armor yeah we're gonna give all of them personal armor i think medikit would have been no medikit is only right when you've got the armor so they can survive more shots. They're not really surviving shots at the moment. Okay, that's it. All of them have got personal armor. Turn around. I beg you, turn around. Thank you. Perfect. Scout. Scout. Wait, why does that scout have a pistol? What the heck? Sotos. Sotos, you're strong. You've got the armor of using Luna's stuff. You must be very, very proud of yourself. Ninja Nier, you're strong. I don't know who was using this, but you must be proud. Yeah, bro, you're very strong. You are extremely strong. Scout Prime, Scout Prime. I don't know why we have these things on us. I'm sure it was during the day. I'm almost sure it was during the day. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. That's it from me. I'm going to save and exit here. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. And yes, although we lost the we lost all the important soldiers, it wasn't good, but it's not terrible. As long as we keep the soldiers that have the flying suits and the heavy plasmas, we can get ready for psionics. Okay? But it is sad that we lost Luna and me. Yeah. Um that that high explosive was definitely terrible. But uh love you guys. And see you guys tomorrow for some survival evolve action pumping action good night guys cheers